so parabolic microphones, can they work through a window? I'm assuming they can't work through like a solid door, but what about something clear like a window? Well, not very well. Uh, the, the parabolic microphone only amplifies the sound coming from in directly in front of the dish. So if the sound has to pass through an object like a window pane, sound will be reflected back into the room instead of coming back out of the room. Uh, only a portion of that sound energy is transmitted through the window pane, and the same is true with a door or a wall. Very little of that sound, uh, depending on the window and door, of or the door and the wall, of course, very little of that sound will transfer through. Most of it will be reflected back into the room. Now, sound can pass through a screen or a fabric, uh, so if the sound source is close, are located close to that fabric or screen, you will capture a good amount of that sound energy. Uh, on the other hand, if you place the parabolic microphone uh, behind or near a screen or fabric, there will be very little effect on the sound that is captured. So for example, uh, security people, uh, if they want to capture uh, sound out of a a van or something, they can use a screen or a fabric uh, in the window so that that sound energy passes through. Mm, okay. <laughs> and that's how you keep the, the parabolics sort of camouflaged at baseball fields as well, right? In many cases, the parabolics at baseball field is actually behind the signage that you see behind home plate. So again, the sound passes through uh, the green screen fabric that they have behind home plate. 